Hi guys, it's Happy Back. Today I'll be opening up the newest starter deck for the One Piece card game, which is the Three Captains. So this starter deck is sort of a special edition, as it's actually called an ultimate deck instead of a starter deck, even though it's SD10. It features the Supernova Trio Captains, Luffy, Law, and Kid together with their crewmates as the central theme of the deck. Okay, let's open it up. And this is what's all inside. Here are the cards. Cool. The Dawn card has foiling on it. And here's the deck box. And of course, we also have the game guide. Oh, I see something here. Oh, wow. So we have here the full art deck artwork in the back. That looks amazing. Can be a great poster actually. Although there's too many fold marks. Let's put this aside for now and let's move on to the cards. So first we got these special Dawn cards here with a really clean foiling on each one. Just gonna count this real quickly. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A total of ten foil dawn cards. And now we have our first leader card, which is of course Luffy. And that's just gorgeous. He looks so detailed here, and the red purple color combination fits him so well. The three captains are all red purple leader cards, and if I'm not mistaken, the first types of red purple leader cards introduced to the game. Oh, we actually have kid tears stuck behind Luffy. Now, kid here is another beautiful artwork. The foiling here even looks much better than Luffy's, especially the way the lightning effects highlight his action pose. I'm expecting Law to be next, but he might have been mixed up somewhere. Not stuck here either. Moving on, we got four copies of Sanji. We actually got some foiling in here, even though this is just common rarity. Next, we have two copies of Jinbei. Another common card, but also with some foiling. Next is the first SR of the set, two copies of Luffy as a red character card. Simple and clean artwork, very nice. Next are four copies of Killer. So it looks like all the cards of this set will have foiling. It really is a special set. Next, we have four copies of Penguin and Sachi. Four 
four copies of Jean Bart. The foiling looks a bit more prominent here compared to the others. Now we have the second SR of the set, two copies of Purple Law. The foiling on the room animation sphere is a nice touch. Next, we have four copies of Kid's Crewmate Heat. And of course, we also have Beppo here for copies as well. And here's the third SR of the set, two copies of Kid. I like this artwork the most out of the three SR captains. Action poses really fits Kid well. We have another four copies of Kid's crewmate, Wire. And next we have our two copies of a Red Luffy event card. Another pair of Luffy's event card, this time featuring his Calm Gatling. We also have another event card here featuring Kid, two copies as well. Next, we actually have here another SR in the deck. Four copies of SR Zoro. This is labeled as part of OP01 for some reason. I guess this is an alt art of the card from that set? Maybe. Next, we have four copies of Nami, our first rare of the set, surprisingly. This is also labeled as part of OP01. And Leader Law is still not here, though. <laughs> that was the last card in the pile. Let's double check again in case it got stuck as well. Oh, ha! It's here. Why are these cards stuck to each other? Well, this has got to be my favorite one out of the bunch. And that's all the cards of SD10. Oh, and here is the deck box featuring the artworks of the leader cards. It comes with a nice card divider too. So that's it for the SD10 The Three Captains Ultimate Deck Opening. Please like and subscribe for more One Piece card game content. Thanks for watching!